Hello and welcome to a better late but never edition of Cash Stuffing on the Savvy Budget Girl. My name is Wendy Coop and we are cash stuffing for the first paycheck of December slash end of January. So let's get to it. Thank you for joining me. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Again, like I said, this is going to be a cash stuffing video. I don't know how quick it's going to be, but I know about how much money we should have. I've already given my husband $100 for gas and $50 for his spending money. So let's count and see how much we have left, okay? Let's bring out the trusty tray. My cat here is here off camera, so if you see him, don't mind him. So one, two, three, four, five, 56. One, two, three, four, seven. Hold on. I'm at six. 20, 40, 60, 80, 7. 20, 40, 60, 80, 8. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 86. So seven or eight, 86. I lost count. <laughs> so that's okay. That's okay. Because it's all going to work out. I, I'm confident that it'll all work out. I should have used the calculator. It was right here. So we only have a few categories to stuff today. So let's get to it with my wallet, my trusty wallet. Um, we're going to start with groceries. How have you guys, how are you guys doing by the way? How was January for you? Because I felt like it started off really slowly and then really sped up towards the end. So like, tell me if that was your experience. And it may be because I was at a conference at the end of January and spent like a ton of money, mostly on the hotel. So that's another story for another time. Let me know if you want to hear that story. So a hundred dollars is going into the grocery envelope and that's going to be one, two, three, four, five because I've already spent some money oh there's money in here oh there's a one dollar bill in here so that's going to go into the dollar savings challenge um I'm doing a five dollar challenge and a one dollar challenge and basically at the end of the month what ones and fives are left over are what are going into a separate bag and at the end of the year we will count up and see how much we save throughout the year so Easy peasy savings, um, if you wanna try that. Um, put it in an envelope, put it in a clear cosmetics bag. Whatever you have, just save the money. So next up is gas. It's supposed to be $260, but I gave my husband $100 already. So we need 160. So we're gonna do a 50, five 20s, three, four, five, and then a 10. Yep, that's 160. <laughs> 50s always throw us off, you know? You know what I'm saying? So that takes care of that. Nothing for coffee, nothing for a household or eating out because we've been using that for debit, using the debit card for that, stuff I forgot. Same thing, debit card, internship. Spending money, you guys, it has been, I did a 5K this morning. So I have been spending money on running gear and stuff. Excuse my nails because they're dirty. I haven't taken a shower yet. I still have my exercise ring on. I'm sorry. I just needed to get the video done. So I have basically spent my personal money already on sunglasses, running gear, uh, recovery, waffles. Yes, th that's a thing. Recovery waffles. <laughs> So we're not stuffing anything for spending money for me. My husband already got his spending money. And so the last thing we need to do is car maintenance, which is it not in this. Um, that's probably the rest of this money right here. So we should have. So we also used the emergency money during the uh, conference. We had to use all of that $500. So I'll be putting that back in at some point, but let's move on to car maintenance. We're moving on to car maintenance because I'm supposed to drive to Dallas from Florida at the beginning of March. 
and my car is almost at 90,000 miles. So I need to get that service done and I need to get my brakes looked at. So we're estimating it'll cost about $626, or not 626, that's how much I'm stuffing. At the most, we're estimating $700. So right now I'm stuffing what should be $626. So let's see how much we have. So one, two, three, four, five. Fifth, we'll set the 50 aside. 20, 40, 60. 70, 75, 76. So 76 plus 50. Let's break out the calculator. 76 plus 50 is 126. And 126 plus 500 is 626. So that is exactly how much we need for right now. And I'm gonna stick that in the car maintenance envelope. And you guys, if you want envelopes like this made, check out my Etsy shop. Um, I do have the these uh, frosted envelopes and the Cricut machine to personalize your envelopes. Um, I think the order is five at a time. So check out the Etsy shop. The link is in the show notes or in the description. Sorry, podcasting brain. But that is all we're stuffing today. So like I said, it was going to be a quick video. And then we have our extra dollar that's going into the dollar savings challenge and we've got our money stuff for right now everything else that's not cash is going to be on the debit card we'll see how that goes you guys it's going to be interesting <laughs> until next time thanks for tuning in bye